que dime lo que tú quieres de mi coqueta. Sé lo que te gusta es salir y se suelta. Pango a la reggaeton pa' mí, que muñeca. Me gusta salir y se lo sí. Welcome back you guys to another video. I know I haven't posted in the longest but we've we've been extremely busy taking care of other things, other projects uh, that we're actually going to bring you uh, soon. We cannot disclose anything but we're working on other projects and we're gonna give you an update uh, soon enough. But as you saw on the uh, introduction uh, what we're going to do today is talk about our approval for the Apple card from Goldman Sachs. So this sexy thing right here, we're gonna be talking about it. Uh, we're gonna talk about our process, how we apply, how we got approved, and everything in between. It is a beautiful car though, and we own uh, several different metal cards, but this seems to be kinda like the most robust one. Like, the other cars are metal, but they don't really sound like this. It's crazy. Again, this is going to be a super short video. I just want to keep that habit of posting something at least once a week. I know that I think the last time that I posted a video was about a week or two weeks ago. We've been preoccupied with other uh, projects of which we're going to talk to you about in other videos in the future, not right now. But okay, so I just wanna give you an example of the, the material, the metal for this car. Like, these are metal cars, right? All three of these. Uh, you guys know the um, Credit AI is a metal card, okay? You can hear how it sounds. And then you have the Chase Preferred is also a metal card and this is how it sounds and then you have the apple and this is how this one sounds so it's the difference is pretty great now you know lately um i have accumulated by now I have accumulated like a very nice amount of business credit and what I'm doing is just put a halt on you know any applications you know I haven't been applying for any accounts lately um, because of right now I can leverage all of the business credit that I've been accumulating throughout the last you know six months so now it's time to not hoard that uh, you know those straight lines but now it's time to utilize those straight lines and uh, leverage those uh, straight lines to either create an extra uh, income stream or uh, grow your business okay so now it's time to act it's action time it's not time to hoard you know hoarding all these uh, straight lines and without taking action uh, I don't think that uh, serves the purpose of, you know, building business credit to expand your business or create um, more income streams. So that's why I am taking this time uh, lately to work on my personal credit. Now, way after I started building my business credit, I understood and I've heard other creators like uh, Credit Plug saying that you need to build your business, your personal credit. Your consumer credit has to be as good as your business credit. 
because there's some um, there's some type of deals. There are certain deals that uh, would not take place. You would not be able to take advantage of if you don't have a good uh, personal credit. So lately, I've been working on that. You know, working really tirelessly. Uh, this is why, like right now, we've been approved for this um, Apple Card. Um, also, uh, we have uh, this also high limit Navy Federal Amex as a American Express, and uh, this other one from Navy Federal. So this is why we've been focusing and there's another card coming up that we're going to make a video. It's going to be a surprise. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to talk about it uh, right now in this video. But what I'm trying to tell you is that it is imperative that you uh, work on your personal credit. So I've worked with some lenders, some business lenders uh, funding my business that those deals wouldn't have been able to take place had I had like a horrible credit. So you have to uh, not only focus on building your business credit, but also you have to focus on getting your personal credit in order so that uh, when comes the time that you actually need your personal credit, uh, you know, you're all set and that's not going to hinder any deals for uh, you know from taking place in your benefit uh, but in any case so today the start of the day is uh, the Apple uh, MasterCard from Goldman Sachs that we got uh, this is definitely very minimalistic uh, look uh, very modern if you can see how the Goldman Sachs letters uh, shine there uh, if you haven't noticed, there are no numbers on this card, no numbers at all. Like you can, you can see here, there's no numbers. This is the back. Um, this is, uh, the stripe that you swipe if you're paying somewhere. And this is the front. It has the, uh, the chip here. It has my name here. And then it has the Apple logo right here so there's no number on this card all right guys um another update that i wanted to give you is uh and this card that i haven't talked to this card about this card really and i i think i mentioned something in another video about being approved for the uh exxon texaco business gas card okay so if you can see here, it says um, our business name. Uh, this is another business that we have and that we also started to be, uh, build business credit for this uh, other business of ours. Um, but again, guys, just a short video, keep you in the loop of what we're doing. I recommend that you keep an eye on our shorts, the short videos that we're putting up. Uh, we try to be a little loose with these uh, shorts that we're putting out, a little more informal, a little casual. Uh, if you've noticed, I'm not so uptight on those shorts as I am on the videos that I put out for you guys. But keep an eye, keep an eye on those videos, those shorts, because I, uh, you know, upload some updates there of accounts and things that I'm doing. Um, also on the posts. Um, just keep an eye on those uh, posts uh, that you put, we put in our community, on our YouTube community. Uh, we're doing tons of things, guys, so just keep tuned. Uh, once all that is secured and finalized, I am going to give you an update as to which projects we're talking, we're working on. Uh, remember that I brought you the projects on the uh, the cars, the smaller fleet of cars that we acquired. So there are other things that we are working on. And if you have been following my videos from when we started, then you probably will figure out what are the projects that we're uh, working on and what are the projects that I'm talking about so mysteriously. Uh, but again, guys, thank you so much. Uh, for watching this video let me know what you think about the Apple card have you applied for it uh, when I applied they said it was going to be a soft pull so 
how do you apply for the car was it a soft pull what was the credit limit I don't talk much guys about credit limits I mean I I really don't I don't think it's necessary in some cars I do say the credit limits but for this Apple one they gave me $750 and uh, I'm pretty sure that as you use the card, they'll, they'll increase um, uh, the limit. Now for this uh, American Express, uh, maybe federal, uh, they give me, I think it was $6,700. They gave me $6,700. Uh, this one is a secure uh, credit card from Navy federal. Actually, I got this one first. Okay, and after I used it for about 90 days, then I apply for this one. So again, just working on uh, my personal credit slowly but surely. Um, again, like I said, if you have excellent business credit, but you don't have good personal credit, then when you try to access funding, uh, it's going to be hard for you to be approved for funding from any lenders without actually uh, putting in your your social security number your SSN number uh, alright guys thank you for watching the video I hope to see you soon I'll give you that update again keep an eye out on the shorts and the posts that we are uh, uploading in our community so thank you so much and I'll see you soon peace I'll see you.